at this moment, my man Bailey, who is from where I'm from, from my hometown. Yeah, he represents where I'm from, man. So this is my guy Bailey against Rainyar. And Rainyar is, of course, the older brother of the Bagali Brothers. He's the legend. Yeah. But he's been second place so many times. Yeah. Is this the year where he can take the title? I don't know. What do you think? Well, let's see how this first battle goes. All right. Bailey, let's go. It starts with the gallant clap. All right. Nice variation. Some bounces. Come on, Bailey. Let's go. Little touch there. All right. Uppers. Very smooth. All right. Down back. All right. Yes. The spinning shoulder. Yeah, yeah, Lekker Bailey. Let's go. Awesome. He's very clean. Yeah. Oh, that was nice. And around the world in the cross position. A little transition and a little mistake. A great round by Bailey. Yes. Okay, here goes Brunier, one of my favorite freestylers of all time. Uh, brother of Ireland. But um, has never won any world titles, European Championship, I, uh, he has won, he has won the Norwegian Championship and he was second in Red Bull Freestyle 2020, uh, so we're talking about a really world level freestyler here. And you know, one of the most saucy freestylers in freestyle, so here you have it, you know. Look at look at Grunier smiling. He's like, you know, this went good. This went a good. Man, the battle vibe. I missed it so much. Yeah, uh, yeah. All right, Bailey, let's go. Basics, lemons in the middle, very clean, no mistakes. Oh, he wanted to go for the double there, but he missed it. Bailey can be so proud of himself that he made it to the final Super Bowl. Yeah. Like, I don't think he thought of, thought he would make it like one week ago, and he's here now. Yeah. Let's see if he can take on Brignard. Oh, sick transition. Nice. Yes. Oh, that was beautiful. Yeah. All right, Brignard, let's go. Okay, Brignard, second round. Going to the Jordan store, like, you know, it's the easiest thing you have ever done. And <laughs> Brignard is the inventor of this trick doing Toe juggles while standing on your hand, and uh, maybe from this perspective you can see how how high he hits the ball while being in Jordan's ball. And here he's got some very saucy sit downs, and it's really nice. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Uh, yeah. That that there was a little drop, but you know. I think Brunier is feeling pretty confident. Oh, he wanted to go bouncy, bouncy, and then up. Yes, clutch, and oh, that's good. Cool. Little battle attitude by Bailey. Yeah. And the pistol. Oh. oh, he wanted to do the double. Here goes Brunier. Wow! Nice. Like, that's not the most difficult thing in the world, but it looks so beautiful when he does it. Uh, okay, this is maybe, you know, if you do uppers, um, if you do it like this, be my guest, do as much as you want. I could watch this all day. Like, yeah. It's also the hair, right? The hair thing. Yeah. Yeah, I can see. Brunier had some. Uh, he had some difficulties yeah. like with the, the finishes of the, of the rounds. Yes, yes. But um, all in all, really, really uh, solid battle. Solid battle. And about Bailey, I must still say that I, I didn't know Bailey like before this Super Bowl. Maybe he, he's been to some tournaments before, but, uh, but this two years of uh, dark times with COVID and everything. Yes. I think he took a gap year from school and uh, he started his own business, he started a podcast. Actually, his podcast, podcast is called Press. 
It's about freestyle football. I can really recommend you check it out. Start your own business with clinics and freestyle outlets. Fully focusing on freestyle. That being said, it is Brignard that goes to the quarterfinals. Yeah. Respect the both sides. Uh, yeah, um, amazing, amazing. Um, now uh, we are going to have a teeny tiny bit of break. We are going to have uh, you and me are going to have, I say, a dessert break. Yes, and uh, the wonderful uh, Paloma and Miran Pirner are going to be with you guys. Uh, just for the people that don't know them, who are Paloma and Mira? Before we go out, we have to pick them up. Yeah, Paloma, who is a world champion, uh, a huge community leader in female freestyle. Miran Pirner has been freestyling maybe 15 or 20 years, has pushing the sport like forward and forward. But uh, always has been, yes, it's been.